Hey guys, today I uh, introduce you guys a feature which is called HSIP, uh, which stands for the Hot Standby uh, Router Protocol. So, what is the feature used for? Uh, suppose that, for example, if we have the well, this is the cloud, this is the internet here, and we got the router here, and this is the switch here, okay, something like that, and this is the PC. So, we have two PC here. So the gateway of of this PC is this router. Uh, for example, like um, this router. For example, like uh, this router, I mean, goes down, I mean, power off, or uh, have a disconnect uh, by a way, because the wire problem or the hardware problem, something like that. So these two hearts cannot access to the internet here. Okay, this is the problem. So that's why HSRP come to play around. So I'm going to introduce you guys uh, on the scenario here. So I have the primary gateway and the secondary gateway. So the primary gateway means that the the router can uh, uh, send the traffic to the primary gateway and to the router zero. Which one is this? I uh, suppose this one is the internet. And for example, if this router goes down, uh, laptop will turn turn the traffic and send it through the secondary gateway and through the uh, router zero. Which is the internet here? This is uh, something like that. So the concept of that uh, this. The primary gateway and the secondary gateway, both of them they create the virtual router. I mean, virtual gateway here at the middle. Okay, and it's gonna look like this. First of all, the virtual gateway, the virtual router we cannot see, and actually the traffic uh, goes through the virtual router, and uh, and go from the virtual router to the internet here. So, uh, primary gateway here is the gateway is the router that represents the virtual router here. For example, this one is goes down. Uh, the secondary one will represent for the virtual gateway in the middle here. Okay, this is the concept. So how to configure that? The configuration is kind of easy. So make sure the uh, error of the IP address reach uh, have the reachability with each other. So the configuration we have to go to the uh, interface um, of the gigabit zero slash one here. Make sure make sure that the primary gateway and the secondary gateway uh, they are in the same segment here. Okay, they mean the same network. So we have to go to the interface uh, gigabit zero slash one here. Okay, um, and then we have to type the standby. All right, standby, and then we have the ID. I mean the group number. I'm gonna say one. Uh, I have to type the virtual IP. I mean virtual gateway IP address. Is this the IP? I'm gonna choose the ten zero hundred. Uh, first of all, like hundred, and wait, let's check it out. Okay, hundred and hundred. So I'm gonna use this IP as the virtual gateway here. Uh, here virtual gateway is the uh, the vis invisible router here. This is the virtual gateway here, IP address. So I'm going to use that and click enter. And then I'm going to set the priority on this on the primary gateway to make that gateway as the primary router. I'm going to just stand by one and the primary I'm going to type um, default is 100 so I'm going to put 150 okay and that's it. So on the secondary router we had to do it the same thing one I'm sorry g0 slash one here oh forget slash one here and stand by one IP 10 0 100 and 100 here I'm going to put the priority uh, as the 50 okay so the higher priority is the uh, chance to be the uh, uh, primary gateway okay so as you can see the locks here I see that a uh, before you're going to speak to the standby mode and then it's now in the actual mode okay and on the second router it's changed the stat to the standby. So this means that the second router is a standby mode and the primary router here is not in the active mode. It means that the traffic is going to go from the router. I'm sure you got from the PC client here. Go to the switch and then go to the primary and then go to the internet here. Okay. So I'm try, uh, let's try to ping uh, to the 
So you can see here, I already put the gateway, the virtual IP address here, 10 0 10 So now I try to ping to uh, 1.101. Okay. All right, maybe I have some problem. Let's check it out again. Okay. Can I ping it to ping to ten zero hundred hundred? I can't even ping to the gateway. Ten zero hundred hundred. Ten zero ten hundred. I think I'm wrong. So run. Okay, it should be hundred hundred, not ten hundred. Okay, I put the wrong uh default default gateway here. This wants to be like this. Okay, so I ping again. Ping ten zero hundred hundred is the gateway. You can ping for successful, and I try to ping to the ping to the one dot one dot one dot one here, and you can see that the ping also successful. So the one dot one dot one here is the lo uh, is the land of the uh, router zero here. Yes, it's the one dot one dot one dot one here that I config on the router zero. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video and thank you very much.